Hi, my name's Heather and I'm the Vice President of Learning Experiences here at Discovery Place. I wanted to take a moment to check in and see if everyone's staying healthy and staying calm. It's very uncertain times right now when we are hearing so much about washing our hands and wearing face masks and all the things that humans have to do to try to keep ourselves safe during this time. I thought I'd take this opportunity to share a little bit about the special adaptations the American alligator has that have helped them survive in their environment for over 150 million years. The American alligator is a very resilient animal. It's an apex predator, which means it has no natural predators once it's full grown. This is a juvenile, and you'll notice that from time to time, you might hear this chirping noise. That chirping noise is a special adaptation that American alligators have that allows the mother to care for them when they're young. That's a very unusual characteristic. Most reptiles don't have a mother who cares for their young. After they lay their eggs, their job is typically over. But the American alligator can stay with their mother for up to two years after they've hatched. And that barking noise is a way to let the mother know where they are so that she can take care of them and make sure that they stay safe. Something else that's really interesting about the alligator is their um, armor system. So under the skin on the top, the alligators have a row of bony scoots, or um, osteoderms as they're known, that lit right under the surface of the skin. I'll show you in a moment, but I have an osteoderm an osteoderm here that I wanted to show you. So they have a series of these bony plates that run the duration of their back down to the tail. This acts as a body armor and protects them from attacks and danger. Let me put it up here so you can see. You can notice that there's this row of the osteoderms that run all the way down. Another feature of the American alligator is that they are able to um, replace their teeth. It's really important as an apex predator, you wanna make sure that you're able to um, hunt and search for food. So the alligators have a series of teeth on the top and the bottom of their jaw, and those teeth, as they wear out, replace over time. So as humans, we only lose our teeth once. We have our baby teeth and then we have our adult teeth. But after we lose those, you typically have to go see the dentist or do some sort of um, reconstruction work. For the alligator, as the tooth wears out, a new tooth will replace it. Alligators can have up to 3,000 teeth in a lifetime. So it's a really useful feature for helping them to hunt and to um, protect their domain. A third thing that I thought I'd share about the alligator is they have three eyelids. So as humans, we have two eyelids. We have our top and we have our bottom. The alligator actually has a third eyelid. It's an eyelid that comes from the inside out and it's a almost clear or sheer protective layer. That serves as almost like that protective layer is like wearing goggles. So when they're swimming underwater, they can have that eyelid come over and it protects their eyes, which is really useful because you wanna make sure that um, eyesight is an important sight to have, especially if you're hunting for food. And they're often hunting for food in very dark, murky water. And so anything that helps with their eyesight is important. Well, I hope you've enjoyed learning a couple facts about our alligator friend here today. Just as a reminder, we wanna keep everyone healthy and safe during these times. So we hope you do lots of hand washing, take a chance to go outside and, and relax, and then we'll